Okay guys, so I just got off the phone with Skechers.com and why is my camera like this? Okay, good. It's straight now. I just got off the phone with Skechers.com and they are... You do have to wait on the phone for a little bit, but they are so helpful. I bought these adorable cat shoes. Guess what? I bought them in the wrong size. So I need to get a size six and a half. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And so I called customer service to, to ask and see if I can exchange them. And the lady said yes. So she was super sweet. And I like when customer service people are sweet. I've had one that basically told me my I'm wasting my time calling them. This one was sweet. The Hasbro one that I called one year, well not one year, like a couple years ago, was sweet. Thank you, Skechers. I'm going to go and exchange my shoes on Skechers.com later tonight, and it's going to be epic. I just got finished with the test. I was not expecting a test in my macro class today, but he was like, Catherine, you want to redo your test? And I was like, why? And he goes, you and a couple other people need to redo the test. And I was like, okay. I looked at my test score. I'm so glad he let me do it. I don't know what happened. Last time the test came, I blanked. But then he let me use my notes and everything on it. So that was a good thing. So I passed the test. And I hope this final Thursday is not going to be a piece of trash. Because I don't want that. I want to pass. I want to pass. But anyway, I'm going to go home and be lazy. Hey guys, sorry I didn't vlog much yesterday. I was just going to school, redid a test, went home, kind of sad, I don't know why. Took a four-hour nap. Then I woke up and ate some dinner, sat around watching YouTube, and then about 10 o'clock at night, maybe 9.30, I couldn't really remember, I started thinking about my macro test that's coming up, that's the final for the test, for the class, and I started getting upset, and I panicked, what I would call a panic, but I think it's just me being hard on myself, because I immediately started thinking that I was going to flunk, or I wasn't going to pass, or I was going to blank on the test, or I wasn't going to trap, or I wasn't going to know any of the answers and that I was going to fail the class and let myself down, let the school down, let the class down, and more importantly, let my father down. And I, I feel when I fail a class, I let my father down. I don't fail classes, but I feel like when I do bad, I upset my father, I upset myself, and I got so upset that my chest hurt, my throat hurt, my head hurt, I was bloody red crying, and I just kept thinking that I'm disappointing everybody, and then I was just going to fail the class and everything, and so I got upset, and I thought YouTube would calm me down, but every time I put on a YouTube video to calm myself down, I had to turn it off because I would cry again. I would think and cry. So what I did is I prayed to the Lord and then I turned on some Christian contemporary music and it happened to be Hillary Scott and the Scott family and that calmed me down. I turned it on on my Amazon Echo and it calmed me down and I didn't go to bed till like 3 a.m. in the morning because I was so upset and was calm and I started watching YouTube in a calm manner and stuff so that's why I didn't film much because I was upset. But I finished my study guide, and it's 16 pages long, and it's dreadful, but I think I should do good. And, yeah, that's my intervene. Sorry. But now on to the today's vlog. Hi, guys! So I'm about to show you what my Reddit gifter showed me. My Reddit gifter gave me all my ramen. Remember back then when I told you I was going to make it up? Well, I'm about to open it on camera. Well, so the first thing that we got is Kung Fu Instant Original Beef Flavored. Beef Flavored's my favorite. Then we've got Hot and Spicy 
I guess it's just hot and spicy flavored. Mmm, can't wait. Then we have hot and spicy flavor, but this is just another hot and spicy flavor. Stir fry noodles. Mm. Then we've got hot chicken ramen. I gave my ramen at person the same one, but a beef flavored. And then we have white curry flavored. Never had that flavor before. Oh, there's so much. Then we got spicy flavored. I can dig. Then we have noodle soup. <laughs> then we have shrimp flavored. Never had shrimp flavored before. I know. That's weird. Then we've got peppered beef flavored. Hmm. Then we have a tub that has anime characters on it, and it is all in Japanese because I can't read a single bit of it. So if you can read it, you can please tell me down below what it says. This looks great. Then we've got another one. <laughs> And the last one that we have in the box is stir fry spicy beef flavor. So I want to thank my Reddit gifter. Thank you so much. And I hope you liked your gift. Hey guys, it's um, Alexa, what time is it? The time is 12.56 p.m. It is 12.56 p.m. according to my Amazon Echo. I have been up since about 9.30 doing homework. I have a macro final tomorrow, pray that I pass it, and I've been working on the study guide, 13 pages long. So I decided to go to Starbucks anyway, so I got me a hot chocolate, no mocha drizzle, and chocolate powder on top of my whipped cream instead, and then I got this violet drink but I got it with not coconut milk because coconut milk is not my thing I got it with 2% milk mmm I think this drinks not my thing unless you have to put the coconut milk in it and then it's just I don't know I got mom with black tea with no sugar with strawberries in it so we're gonna share this drink me and mom cuz it's not the best I won't be getting it again and then this is my sucker Hey guys, so I got a couple things from Amazon and I want to show you what they are. First, I'm going to show you, this is for my Apple Pencil, so it doesn't, like, get lost or anything because I'm really good at losing. I don't want to lose it because it's expensive as heck, but it's basically a case and it holds my Apple Pencil, it's charging port, and then it has, like, two little places where you can put like the cable to charge it with or headphones or something like that but I picked out a flower design because I'm obsessed with flowers no one knows that until now and then I got a case for my iPad I think it's the cutest thing ever because the back is clear so you can see that I got the gray I can't remember the technical name they put it so you could see the gray and then it's a composition notebook it's so cute and it also is one of these note notebooks that if you close it it puts your iPad in sleep mode and it fits and it's perfect so perfect I could write on it if I felt like it but I'm not going to and then my dad bought me not out of the case yet but I'll take it out of the case well I'll take it out of the case so I can show you. I got a set of two so I can have one at home and one at college. These are 
closet shoe no closet shoe organizers I don't have that many shoes but I don't really want my shoes to take up space on the floor in my closet so I thought this was cute and it's like a little velcro and it's got 10 storage component it's custom customizable and it is basically a like little cubby for your shoes and I got it in gray because gray matches pretty much everything and then my dad surprised me with my Funko Pop he got me a Gilderoy Lockhart Funko Pop I'm obsessed with him so it's gonna go by my shrine I'm about to show you my shrine in just a minute it's gonna go with my shrine that I have I got those as a Reddit gift, and it's signed by the actual actor. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna go, um, do stuff. I'm gonna close it out here, because I'm gonna basically do homework for the rest of the night and study for my two finals that I have tomorrow. So, as always, bye, everybody!